used to be a place of peace, but now thieves are targeting visitors at Fort Logan National Cemetery in Denver. Someone is stealing from their parked cars. Let's go there live to Jamie Leary, who spoke with a woman who was victimized. I spoke with Barb Shea. She was parked right on the side of the road visiting a headstone just a couple rows back, so close to her own vehicle, but she didn't hear a thing. Fort Logan says it's been doing its own patrolling around here because of reported incidents. As for Barb Shea, she just hopes that by sharing her story, it's going to prevent somebody else from becoming a victim. I usually trace around the cross. At least five times a year, you will find Barb Shea right here visiting her husband, Michael. And I talk to him and tell him about the grandson that's coming in October. This is exactly what she was doing last Friday afternoon, less than 100 feet from her car. When I got up and went back to my car, my purse was gone. She admits she forgot to lock it, but never dreamed somebody would target her here. Who would do this? I mean, who would do this, really? Fort Logan told her she isn't the only one. I think there was a, a pretty a pretty steady trend. It's despicable. Kevin Johnson is the assistant director for the cemetery. He says this type of theft is sadly common at Fort Logan. You know, I've worked at a lot of cemeteries across the nation, and I've never seen this before. The same day Barb's purse was stolen, a member of the Honor Guard had his truck stolen. Other similar incidents were reported throughout May. People just prey on people that are vulnerable. I will never feel the same coming here. The one thing that brings a smile to her face is thinking about how Michael might react if he were alive. He'd probably say, if I find out who did this, I would kick their <laughs> He would. Oh. Vietnam, how can you not be tough when you're in a war? As simple as it seems, Barb hopes sharing her story reminds others to lock their car. I always lock my car, and it was a lapse in, in judgment on my part. Even more concerning for Barb, she says they also stole her garage door opener. Fort Logan says many of these incidents, unfortunately, are a result of unlocked cars. So that's a good reminder to always lock your car. Denver police say they are investigating. Live from Fort Logan National Cemetery, Jamie Leary covering Colorado First. Thank you for sharing her story, Jamie.